Preposition. A preposition is a word which shows the relation of a noun or a pronoun with another word in a sentence. Preposition is divided into three parts that is preposition of place, preposition of time and preposition of direction. Starting with preposition of place. If I talk about preposition of place, first we differentiate between at, in and on. Differentiate in the sense when at, in and on is used when you are talking about preposition. In context of place, the preposition at indicates in the location of. It speaks about location. It speaks about position to or towards the direction of. To or towards the direction. For an example, location if i speak about location for example at a large crowd gathered at the market so here i'm speaking about location if i speak about the position he crossed out a wrong word at the center of the page so at the center of the page here we are speaking about the place to or towards the direction if I say look at him he seems tired so I'm actually asking the person to look towards that person to look to that person I'm speaking about the place again in preposition in indicates within the confine or inside within or inside for example here the valuable are kept in the same. The valuable are kept in the same. That means it is inside the. It is inside the big place. Then within, like we live in Spain. So we live in Spain means in the big city. Okay. Now, next preposition on indicates like preposition upon and above the surface of. If I speak about above the surface the contact between the two surface contact between two surface and the location location at or along for example if i speak about on in the purpose of place position on the surface for example if i say the vase is on the table on the table means the vase is on the surface of the table Contact between the two surface. I noticed mud on her trouser. Between the two surface, that is the trouser and the mud. Location at or along. For example, the house on the beach is surrounded by a palm tree. So on or along. If I'm talking about location, then also you can use the preposition on. Now the difference between above and below as proposition above suggest over or higher than over or higher than for example the hotel is situated above the tree line so it is over or it suggests higher than apart from indicating place the proposition above also suggests few more things and they are superior to if I am talking something about superior to in that case also I, I can use the word above if you are talking something about which is of higher rank then also the preposition above can be used beyond the level or reach of in this case also I will use the preposition above Beyond the grasp of understanding or in preference to. Now, greater than, greater than age, price, temperature or weight. Now, giving you the example of the points which I have discussed. 
the higher as i've discussed that above is used for over or higher than giving you the example of superior to above is also used for superior to for example sudhir placed his country above his family ties above his family ties means is giving a priority or it is giving he is giving more value to the country as compared to his family of higher rank an administrative office is above section office so above means it is of higher rank administration offices in the higher rank as compared to the section officer now beyond the level or reach of he was above suspicion of all so he was not in the level of all of them he was beyond the level means yeah, there is no uh, condition to um, suspicion on him now in preference to my duty is above my personal interest that means duty is the priority then greater than in weight greater than in price greater than in age or greater than in temperature then also we use the preposition above for an example the sack of flour is above 10 kg that means more in weight greater than in weight the price of that overcoat is above rupees 2000 that is rate is above the price here we are talking about price the old man is above 80 above 80 means here i am speaking about age speaking about below in below the preposition below indicate lower than or beneath for example we could see the setting sun going below the horizon as preposition below also indicates for example unworthy of or unsuitable to the two rank or dignity for example it was worthy it was unworthy of him to take part a job below his dignity some expressions which below are for example uh, below the dignity below the freezing point below uh, normal below the surface of water coming on to the next differentiation that is between and among the preposition between indicates intermediate in the space separating two person place or thing here if you speak about two person only then the word between is used and in case of among if you are talking about more than two person this everybody know i guess now for example if i talk about between only in between as i've said it is between uh, it is the intermediate in the space separating two persons places or things for example mukul is between ashish between ashish and ankur that means ashish and ankur are the two person i'm talking about and the third person is between the two the preposition among indicates in the mid of or surrounded by for example there is a house among the tree now speaking more about among among also indicates in the group or it also speak about in the group for example he stood first among the fastest runners of the country so that's what it indicate the same meaning that is more a uh, person uh, more than two people there um uh, next in the association with or in the company of for example sonika left delhi among a group of travelers by the joint action of by the joint by the joint action of for example among us we will get the job done with portion of each of like distribute this among you now if i talk about like i have said previously between is used for uh, for two people if you are talking about and if you are talking about more than two then the word among is used now uh, if you are talking about more than two but in that more than two you are talking about like for example i take five i'm talking about five people and if i'm talking about all these five individually then also the word between can be used now the difference between behind and in front of behind means in 
टू और टू वर्ड द रेयर एट द बैक ऑफ ओके He walked behind me. The propos the preposition behind also indicates on the farther side or beyond. It also indicates on the farther side or beyond in the place or time that has been passed or left by time, which is passed or left by. Giving an example also, their worries are behind them. That means they have been passed or they are left by. Behind is also used for inferior, inferior to or less advanced than. There are many countries still behind us in technology. Talking about in front of, in front of suggests a place before. a place before there is a school in front of our school now beside beside opposite over under and near speaking about these preposition which falls into the category of time place was in the category of place beside the preposition beside expresses next to or by the side of next to or by the side of for example there is a table beside the chair opposite the preposition opposite expresses the meaning across from or facing for example there is a big bus stand opposite the school so that means it is across from or it is facing the same place where you are standing over and under the preposition over indicates in a in a position higher than for example there is a sign of file fort file fort this is what is known as a file fort there is a sign of file fort over the door under indicates in or to the lower position lower position or place than for example the boat is under the bridge speaking about near the preposition near indicates close to within a short distance or time of within a short distance or time of for example we often find shells near beaches